And we're back with the incomparable Emma Thompson and her super duper talented co-star, 13-year-old Alicia Weir. And they are starring in the incredible oh. new movie, Roald Dahl's Matilda, the musical. It's based on the novel. Emma plays the terrible, mm. and she is terrible, Miss mm. Trunchbull, headmistress <laughs> of the boarding school Matilda attends. Take a look. There's the maggot known as Nigel. <laughs> Over there, under those blazers. Oh, Where he's been for the last hour. What? Yeah. You see, Nigel suffers from the rare but chronic sleep disorder, narcolepsy. <clears throat> and what is your name? Matilda. Matilda Wormwood. There you go. Whoa! Alicia. Alicia. <laughs> Can we just say we're so thrilled that you're here. You are absolutely magnificent. Incredible. In this. Okay, and you've always loved to act and sing. Does this feel like a dream come true? Definitely. I have um, two older sisters, um, Katie and Emma Jane, and they both do it as well. They went to a stage school, so I think when I was born, I was just trying to follow in their footsteps, and like I was just waiting until I was old enough until I could go into the stage school and be like them and do their singing classes. So I'm just really trying to follow in their footsteps. Okay, and be like... we're in love with you. <laughs> yes. That's what we're going to say. <laughs> Your whole family is here, which is the cutest thing. Who came? And um, my mom, my dad, my sister, and my I have another sister, but she couldn't come. Oh, well, Aww. we're happy. You know what? I was, all, I was just trying to imagine what it must have felt like to be you when you got the role. We actually have a little clip of you <laughs> learning that you were the one who was selected. Take a look. Let me see. I told you the part of my children in the film. <laughs> Feel like Alicia. It was on my mom's birthday, oh, and I think I, I, it wasn't. <laughs> 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 oh, God. Jenny. Jenny told you it was going to happen. <laughs> now, yeah, finally. Uh, I actually, I'm, I'm jet lagged. It's jet lag. <laughs> nothing to do with you, you horrible little squirt. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, so, yeah. <laughs> it was on my mom's birthday, and um, I don't think you can really plan like what kind of reaction you're gonna have because you don't know what way it could go and um, I was meant to do like a different sort of class and my mum was like the director Matthew wants to talk to you and um, my whole family was there and we didn't really know what to think because I knew that's like so many incredible kids must have auditioned for it so I didn't want to get too excited and my sister was like we'll take a video of it and I was like yeah I don't know and she was like <laughs> But if it's like a no, I'll delete it quickly. <laughs> we are so glad it was a yes. And Emma, one of the things that we learned while researching mm -hmm. you is that obviously you've won every award there is. You're this accomplished, incredible actress. But you did have a variety show that was not an, a success. No. And I only ask, because I feel like kids these days aren't allowed to fail. Yeah. You know, or they oh, feel yeah. like they're not like allowed to fail. Too. I think failure is so important. What did Absolutely. you learn from that? From that, she had a variety show that was not a success, mm. which is hard to believe because <laughs> everything she does is, Emma. A, is yeah. a success. But it was it was really really important. It was one of the most important things I've ever done. It's it, it, because it was a big thing. It was a really big thing, and it took a lot of work. And it's a bit like if you know you've done, le but later in life, you know, if you do something like Matilda, a huge thing that takes a year and a half to make, and then it doesn't work, and it's like you feel like. All the stuffing's being mm -hmm. taken out of you, like a teddy bear that's just been sort of mm -hmm. taken all the, you know, and um, and then you, recovering, you sort of discover what you might have done differently, and then it always leads you in a different direction. Whereas success, note a bene, which is <laughs> Latin, but um, which is what we're having now and what you're having, very young age, is something that it's a really nice feeling, and then it goes away, and then what do you do? So, actually, yeah. both things are important. You can't have failure after failure because then you just go, oh, do you know what, I'm going to do yeah. something else. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to be a chef. <laughs> um, or, but, but have failure, then a success. Yes. That's nice. That's a Mix good combo. Up. Failing is good. So the yeah. next thing you do needs to be absolutely <laughs> dreadful. <laughs> OK, just make sure, all right, that it's just not good. <laughs>
That's the advice just, we have yeah, all day. advice. It's probably not going to happen. Oh. But anyway, because she's so brilliant. Because she's brilliant. Emma, yeah, she is brilliant. Emma, we adore you. We don't we, want you all to we leave. We don't want you to leave. You're amazing. You guys, This everyone's going to go flock it's to this. It's so I'm much sorry. fun. It's going it to be the gonna Christmas be a wild success. movie of the season. And we're yes. so thrilled that you all came to be with Thank us you. today. Thanks for so having us. Thank you. And Roll Dolls, Matilda, the musical. If you're a fan of Roll Doll, if you're not, you're going to yeah. love it. It premieres in select theaters on Friday and... Get ready, because it's on Netflix on Christmas Day.